We never turned to Let's Play Zeus. I guess we are continuing. So, Perseus and Medusa. Which is uh, slightly more challenging, but in shorter. In a time of darkness, discord reigned in Greece, and the people lived apart from each other. Now, a new day is dawning. And the time has come for a leader to rise up and, for the first time, draw the people together, uniting them in a mighty city. Zeus himself has selected you to achieve this remarkable feat and has pointed you to a site in the Argoli. The city's name will be Argos. People will flock to the city in the hopes of learning a trade and feeding their families, and they will expect you to provide for them. Other would-be leaders in Greece are also trying to start new cities. Some of them will achieve a modicum of success, while others will fail completely. You might encounter them in your journeys. Okay. Really? Really, game? Grief. Okay. So, we've got marble... And that's it for resources. Okay, so we need 500 people in a homestead, fleece, and a profit of 500. So let's get the residentials down. Um, I guess here is good. Two, three, four, five, six. Same setup as before. I just prefer this. This setup. Uh, let's see, we need one of those. That. Um, okay. We can't set up a palace, so we don't have access to a tax office. What do we have for food? Fishery. Which will probably go down here. So let's go ahead and set that up. I believe we're going to need four at least. They grow a lot less food. Well, <laughs> they don't really grow food, but they make a lot less food than uh, farms and stuff. Okay, we'll need something here. And I guess we can put the granary there. That there. Alright. Should be good for a while. Still short 20 people, but as soon as they start getting these boats in... Troizan. Okay. So it's not formed yet. We've got Ethiopia who is a rival, and Tanarum? It doesn't matter, it's a beast city, it's like, it, it means we'll have a monster. Um, nah, uh, okay. Put a food vendor down. Okay, they're available. And they don't want anything yet. Okay, now they want fleece. So that is how we will build our economy. And the best place to do that is up here in the meadow. So let's let these people move in. Okay. 
50 unemployed. Let's see, one, two, put a road here. And get that up into the meadows. We may as well just go ahead and do this. Um, let's go straight road here. Okay. So, let's see. Carting shed is eight people. But we're going to need enough to do... Well, to make some for selling. And I don't want them wandering all over the place. So we'll make a nice big fenced-in area. That should be big enough. Put something like that there. One, two, and two. Okay, so it came out pretty good. In that regard. And that should be almost all the people. Oh, we need sheep <coughs> before we can do anything. Is that all of them? Nope. I guess I can put down more. Okay, now. So, let's see. So what does this need? Culture. Okay. Well, we've only got... Wow. We've only got access to theater this time. No, no, no. Drama school. And I guess I'll put that there. Give me a park. Okay, we're going to have 50 people again. And wait a minute, this is only a hovel. I think the next one... We'll, um... Okay, so we're filling up good. Uh, the next one, I believe, is the homestead. So let's spruce up the place so that it will evolve. And since we've got fleece now, we can do a fleece vendor. I don't know why, but <laughs> I just like to put it far away from the food. Because I figure, like, you know, if this were real, you wouldn't want the wool in your food. I don't know. This is some weird little thing I've got. Okay, those are homesteads. So, <laughs> we got a lot of people. Okay. So now we need to make money, and the only way we can do that right now is by selling it. So, well, I, I guess we can put it here, and I don't want to sell all of it, but I think we're going to make enough all the same. I'm going to come down here and tell this to get. Because otherwise it's going to start taking all this stuff to be shipped off. And we don't want that. We've still got an enormous amount of unemployed people here. But um, I'm just going to run it to the end. Let's... Um, Okay, a price increase in flea, so that'll be good for giving us... Okay, so we've already got 500 profit, so we just need to wait till the end of the year. And it will be done. There shouldn't be any unrest. No.
Argos is on its way to becoming a great city, and even the residents of Mount Olympus have begun to take notice. Okay, easy peasy. So, we'll move on to the next episode.